Good morning, everybody. Mike Vaki, PrincetonTrader.com, here with your Thursday market webcast. All right, daily chart, and we continue to consolidate here. Uh, let's zoom it in. Uh, I don't think I want to go in that tight. Um, okay, there we go. Um, so, 2174, 29, you know, 2959.75, and now we've got a couple looks at 2976, which is over the top of 65, um, which we did back here. Um, it's an upper band ride. You've hit it one, two, three sessions in a row. It just hasn't expanded, and it hasn't, um, it, it, it just, it hasn't expanded. This tape's just, the tape's not ready to expand, and, and, and the funny part is, yeah, the bands are compressed on a relative basis, but the bandwidth is still, you know, it's, it's, it's still five and change. It's not, you know, it's, it's not super tight. The ranges are still nice and wide. Yesterday's range was, you know, 65, 60, 67 handles. The range here, you know, so far today, if the market were to close right now, it's a it's a 32 handle range. So the volatility is still there. It's it's just not very directional, which I think is is you know is frustrating at times for people that want to take longer term more positional stuff. For traders, it shouldn't really matter. It's actually kind of a sweet spot. So we didn't do a ton yesterday. Um, we just really tried to stick with what the tape wanted to do. Um, we had um, we had a nice long overnight that got nicked out, and then we spent the we spent the day. Uh, you know, we were long. We got short up in the seventy area, which ended up being a nicer trade than I thought it was going to be. Then the afternoon kind of got a little choppy, uh, but it ended up being a really really you know really solid day, which was fine. Um, as far as today goes. Unless one side or the other takes charge, you're looking at more of the same. And I hate coming in here saying, well, it's going to be more of the same. But look, if somebody doesn't take charge, it's going to be more of the same. We've been hanging out here now for almost 40 sessions. So hourly chart, you can see, you can really see the consolidation. So it had tightened up. You had a little break down there Tuesday. Got it right back to the hourly mid band, though, which is your blue line. That sucks everything back in. False break, false breakout, false breakdown, false breakout, and we're back into the middle. That's, you know, it is what it is. So I want to watch the hourly mid band. I want to see if it's going to hold, if that can break into a look um, at the lower end of the range. Uh, the bulls have not looked good anywhere near that 76 area. So we opened up Globex yesterday. We print a high at 73 half, and then they go ahead and just basically go bidless down to 51 for about slow and steady for about three or four hours. Um, I was out, I came back in and every time I looked at it, it was like, well, I'm not chasing that. I'm not chasing that. I'm not chasing that. And the thing just kept, you know, steadily, you know, heading, heading lower. So, um, we'll see what today brings. Uh, like I said, you got your hourly mid band that's at 58. Volume weighted average price, five minute mid band coming in right now at 53. We still got about an hour and a half, hour 40 before we open. Um, but this, you know, this 52 to 58 area is going to be the real decision point this morning about, you know, does anybody want take control that could get directional? If it decides it does, then 58 to the upside begets 56. 52 to the downside, you get 35. And that's, you know, like I said, that's a nice wide range to work with as far as making handles goes. But as far as getting in anything directional today, I don't know. I don't know. Um, each side has had plenty of chances. And so far, every one of those extended moves has been brought back in. So it's a consolidation. Be thankful it's not a consolidation in a, you know, four to eight handle you know, daily range where you're trying to trade inside of a phone booth and it, that's no fun for everybody. You know, that's, that's, you know, that's, you can't, you can't, you know, you can't trade without a little elbow room. And this tape at least is giving you some elbow room. All right. Take care. Uh, there'll be more stuff out on social. Check that out. Be safe, be healthy, trade them well.
I'll talk to you tomorrow. Follow us over on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat, at Princeton Trader. Check us out on Facebook, and join us for a free trial at www.princetontrader.com. Trade them well.